Hi everyone, I'm Janaka Vaidhi Tilaka. I'm from Gaul, the south part of Sri Lanka. I have done my high studies in business management and marketing. My first career was a senior merchandiser, that is uh, apparel sector. Then I merged with tourism sector as a tourist guide lecturer. In my school time, I have shown many colors in different areas. I was one active president of a school uh, photographer association. As well, I was a member of a school environment association. I have participated many debating contests and I have brought many medals to the school. In athletics, I have shown my colors in 100 and 200 meters even in province level. My favorite is interact with people. I'm very happy to talk to them, listen to them, you know, singing with them, dance with them, share the life with them. And also, I'm very happy to wake up early and you know, do nice walking and as well climb into. Also, uh, um, wherever I have a time, I'm very happy to go to the rainforest and enjoy the breeze of Virgin and see the birds, find their beautiful colors also and listen to them. And I'm a member of uh, Field Anthology Group of Sri Lanka. Tourism is an industry where fully based on service and hospitality. You know, you should have an attitude of always a smile. I think I'm that kind of person. As well, this job helped me to meet my old hobbies. You know, you have a chance to travel, meet people, explore the nature, enjoy the looking at culture. And top of this all, you should be a very good organizer and also pleasant communicator. I think I'm that kind of person. So tourism is, is the best job for me. I'm very happy to work for Workers Tours because they're backed by Sri Lanka, very reputed conglomerate of uh, you know, John Keels Holding, which is among the top five business entities in Sri Lanka. And they're doing very responsible and sustainable tourism business in Sri Lanka. Also, the Workers Tours has initiated with many CSR projects and we know they're continuously searching for the new opportunities and they have committed to protect and preserve the human rights and you know nature, biodiversity, animals. So they never promote and encourage activity which is harm to the animals. They are the only DMC company who got carbon neutral certificate for their vehicle freight in Asia. So they pay us on time and they have a super friendly staff and they are very flexible and they listen to us. So all together with these attributes, it made us very impressed to work for workers to us. So I have no any reasons to go somewhere else. My favorite place in Sri Lanka is Sigiriya Palace Complex. Every time when I go there, it impresses me with beauty of, you know, architectural marvelous, landscape in marvelous, you know, painting, water management. So I have a very reasonable reasons to proud about my ancestor who lived in 5th century AD. As well, you know, clients who come to Sri Lanka, it is the most favorite place for them to visit. And they're always happy to listen to us when you're talking about Sigiri. So we can share many wow factors with them about Sigiri. And it is moderate walking and climbing. And after you went to the zenith of rock, you are rewarded with beautiful breathtaking view of you know, green plains and mountain, as well very salubrious wind and breeze, which is I love for that. You know, although I have more than five years of experience as a tour guide, although I have been visited more than 100 times to the same place, every day is challengeable. Every day is a new day for me because this is the first time that my client go to that place. So challenge I have is to delight my client and ensure all things go very nice way. So for that, how I do prepare? I used to talk with my clients today evening about tomorrow. So after today, all activities or after sight seat we done. So I used to talk to clients about what we are going to do tomorrow and what kind of activity or is it sightseeing and what's the time we are going to start and what's the traveling time and what how many stopovers on the way and how many hours we spend in the activity or site 
and uh, you know what is the, your dress code you need to have it and what the food wear type and what is the lunch time what kind of food you have so we discuss these all thing and then we comes into the single knot so we both in one page we know what's happening tomorrow so it's very comfortable to the clients as well as for me then i literally say bye to the my clients right then after i go to the my room i have some back office work so i used to call you know if tomorrow's work is supposed to done by third party i used to call them and ensure we are coming and if they need to attend with very special requirements of the client i mentioned to them right so if they need pre booking i need to do i just cross check all happen very well and also i ensure my car is clean and neat and i ensure whether water bottle are enough in the car right so i i very detailly in very keenly i think about these factors then i have a very good sleep the next day i wake up and i dress well have a nice breakfast and go to the hotel lobby at least 5 minutes before the time i set with the client so then everything good that is how we manage that's how we prepare our day to day works so you can delight your clients very much there are many beautiful and unforgettable experiences and moments with the my clients among those uh, this thing is will remember forever this is happened at the railway station of nonoya according to our program that is the day we travel from kandy to hill country by a beautiful journey of train and then i drop my client safely to the kandy railway station and i drive to the nonoya as usual we arrive to the nonoya one hour before our clients come arrive so after i arrive to the nonoya railway station I found the beautiful six seven boys were playing here and there at the terminal of the railway station and I further observe the shoes of all of them were out of date and very old looking and with many repairs so I really wanted to help them out but I can't afford for everyone and I can afford for the only one but I talked to them I approached them and I mentioned about my idea so they were all were happy about that and they voluntarily mentioned the name of suresh actually he is the one who has most dirtiest shoe wear so we together went to the nearby shoe place and we brought very nice shoe wear to suresh and suresh were very grateful i saw in it in his smile so after my clients are out to the railway station i told this story and i showed the boys to them i i found this couple were very interesting to that story and suddenly the lady uh, asked from me janaka if you don't mind can you find some nice shoes for the rest of boys so that call were very kindful and we together again with the boys went to the same shoe shop and we found very nice shoe pairs for the rest of the boys so i found the smiles of the old the boys were like blooming flowers and they were very emotional they were almost like crying about the treat we given to them it was unexpected and also me and my clients as well it was very emotional time and i will remember it forever at the same tour when i dropped them to the airport at the last day my client told me janaka we spent a lot of money for our wedding and our this honeymoon but 50 pounds we spent for that boys will remember forever that is a fantastic i will never forget that moment no need to mention how covid-19 affected for the globally especially the tourism sector it was fully affected no single income for us since last march almost one year but i manage with my family business and my wife salary she's a teacher but the beautiful lesson we learned from the covid we have to get used to the simple lifestyle and we should have a differently some saving for our difficulties right and as well we should create some additional income in addition to the tourism industry when something go wrong to survive and and positive vibes i found from this pandemic it give us a beautiful chance to stay with our family almost one year we grow vegetables we grow flowers we cook together we celebrate life together almost one year i think this life chance will not come 
Lanka is among the top 10 countries in the global who successfully managed the COVID. And our vaccination has already started and vaccination administration is going well. And self sector and the tourism sector together has introduced new protocol. We call it safe and secure protocol to the all stakeholders of the industry. So all DMC people, tour guides, you know, hoteliers and other third party suppliers, vehicle providers are well trained about this safe and secure protocol. The people who has no certified are not allowed to do this business going forward. So when you visit Sri Lanka, no doubt you are in very safe hand. We have been trained well how to handle our business with this new normal situation of the COVID. I would like to tell my clients the Majesty's elephants, drowsy but beautiful leopards, mighty blue whales, evergreen rainforest and wildlife, and the Green Valley Tea Garden, Misty Hills, Ayurvedic Wellnesses, and Golden Sandy Beach, Lone Blue Sea. These all together with people of Friendly V, ready to welcome you and we waiting for you. Please visit us, refresh your life while reboost our country and our lives. Thank you very much.